Hi and welcome back to another video. So today I've got a little treat for you in the kitchen. We are looking at the Stoves Fridge Freezer, the STINT50FF, a 233 litre A plus rated fridge freezer with lots of nice features. So let's take a look at it in a bit more detail and see how it performs. So let's start off with the fridge section. It is 147 litres worth of storage and it is beautifully set out. So as you can see here we have multiple shelves and they're really accented with lovely chrome on the end pieces and we've got really crystal clear glass. So I've got this fridge open at the moment and it's just not frosting over. I can see directly through each shelf and it just gives me that ability to see what I've got in the fridge really easily. And backed up with the LED lighting, it just brightens up the whole fridge and makes it really easy to see what's in there. So as we move down, what we have is we've also as well got a lovely little addition, and I think this is a really nice treat from Stoves. It's a lovely wine rack. Now this could be used for anything, whether it be your orange juices or your beers or you know your non-alcoholic juices. But I really do think that you know this is something that a lot of people are looking for. And again, it is removable, so you don't need to have it in there. And the nice thing about that is that you've got the ability to move these shelves up and down. So again, you know, if you need that extra inch, because obviously you might have something like these soups, they need to fit in a little bit differently, you can have that customization of them shelves. So let's look a little bit further down towards the crisper tray. So one of the nice things that I really like about the crisper tray that stoves have done here is it's actually got some control around the humidity. So what you can actually do is you can use this little switch down here at the bottom and it allows you to control the amount of humidity that's going in and out of that crisper tray. So if you've got things like lots of salad leaves or things like maybe avocados or things that are sensitive to humidity, this is going to really help control that and really get the longevity out of your vegetables. So again, a really nice addition from stoves there. So let's take a look at the door in a little bit more detail. So as you can see here, we have three shelves and this just allows us to have that ability to have things like our milk or maybe it might be eggs or you know smaller little pieces like cheeses or salmon or things like that and again with this one you can move these shelves around so if I want this larger one further up I can do that and the customization is really there amongst absolutely everything in this fridge section so I really like that and it's been quite useful from my point of view so another little addition that stove put into the fridge is a lovely little removable egg holder now I really do like these things, it's very simple, it doesn't really cost the manufacturer much to put in there, but I really think it's a benefit. I do like the fact that I've got easy access to the eggs, but also as well I can see the condition of them immediately and have them straight to hand whenever I need them. So one of the other key components that comes with this fridge is the cold airflow system. It's basically based on a commercial fridge system and it allows for the distribution of cold air around the fridge and around the goods that are stored in there. Basically at the top of this fridge is a turbo fan and what it's doing is it's taking the cold air and circulating it around all of the fridge to ensure that everything gets the full benefit of that chiller. So I've had multiple fridges in the past and most of them don't have these sorts of systems. Basically, in the older sort of technology of fridges, you get hot pockets and cold pockets of air. And what you can find is that you may have some butter that does not chill as well as maybe you've got some soups in there. And the thing with the cold airflow system that stoves has within this fridge just allows for that temperature to be consistent from the top of the shelves right down to the crisper. So I really like the fact that that's included in this. So being A plus rated is also as well saving you that money and also as well keeping your food fresher for longer. So let's move a little bit further down and take a look at the freezer. So moving on down, this is the freezer part of the unit. It's 86 litres worth of storage space, which is about six bags worth of shopping. So again, you're going to be able to store quite a lot of frozen foods in here. 
So the space is split into four different compartments, allowing you to have that customization of what you want to store and where you want to store it. So you may have things like ice cubes and things like that that you want to have quick access to, or you might want to pop some larger items in this bottom tray. This is a lot deeper than the other ones as well. They're really easy to open, really easy to pop out. They also as well have auto stop, so again these aren't going to come out, you know, I'm pulling quite hard on that and it's still staying there. But again, very simple to pop out in total. So all you need to do is just tilt it a little bit and straight out it comes. So one of the really nice things that I liked about the fact that yes, it does have four compartments, but what stoves have included, and I really, really like this, is if you don't want the buckets in here or the storage boxes, you've got glass shelf. Now this comes on two shelves, so I can pop these boxes out, and hey presto, I can then have, like I say, very customizable storage space. So if you've got something that's very tall, maybe it might be some champagne bottles, you know, you've got a party coming on and you need to chill them down very quickly. Well, you've got a perfect spot for that. So, you know, summer's coming up, you know, we all want them parties. So again, you know, really nice spaces to be able to pop things in. So let's pop these all back in and take a little bit of a look at what else is in this freezer compartment. So in the same manner as the fridge part of this unit, the cold airflow system is also as well integrated into the freezer part. So at the back of this top part of the freezer, there is a fan and what that's doing is it's distributing all of that cold air just in the same manner as a commercial freezer would. So it's ensuring that you don't have any warm spots or overly cold spots. So again, whether it be from ice cubes right down to meats or vegetables, everything is going to get the same ambient temperature and the same humidity. So really delivering to you the longevity out of your food. So again, like I say, it's going to save you money in the long run. So let's pop this freezer closed and let's go through some of my thoughts. So in summary, this fridge freezer from Stoves is a beautiful appliance. The fact that it is fully customizable from the different levels of shelves that you can use, from the wonderful, wonderful shelves that are included within the freezer area to give you that flexibility for much larger goods, I think that's a real bonus. With it also as well being A plus rated, it's really going to drive down them savings. But I think one of the big things for me is the things like the humidity control and really that turbo fan with the cold airflow system. I'm a big believer in getting as much out of your food produce as possible. So really getting that longevity out of them is a real bonus for me. So all in all, I think this fridge freezer is a definite thumbs up from me and I would really recommend anybody who's looking for a replacement integrated fridge freezer this also as well comes in not just a 50-50 combination, but a 70-30 combination. I would definitely recommend taking a look. So thank you very much for watching the video. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please leave a like. If you've got any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. I'll be more than happy to answer anything you may have. And also as well, click that subscribe button for more videos. Look forward to seeing you in the next one.